okay so the process of the first we need to understand the process of the log box okay wh for what purpose the log box is maintained okay now let's say for example i will give the example now so our business organization our legal entity this one okay now this is the company code this is our company code our customer is a uh, our organization is dealing business with customers then more customers which are there suppose for example uh, for, uh, for example more customers are there for this for our organizations from northern region or from particular city let's say for example from the particular region only okay now what what the what our organization has been decided okay then when our okay so what we have discussed our organization customers more customers from the northern region okay so the customers also when they are making the payment okay by check or okay through the after the payment whatever they made payment the remittance the remittance information okay suppose for example if customer want to make the payment through check okay what will happen they have to prepare the check then they have to send it back to the our organization from the customer okay now i'll give the example this is the our business organization business organization then then we have some okay then what happened we have done sales some activities we we sold some product to this customer customer i will mention jmt limited is a customer i will mention here is a customer okay to this customer we sent the i mean we sold the goods okay then after as soon as we sold the goods to the customer customer has to make the payment it means a customer need to make the payment okay through check let us assume okay customer need to make the payment through check okay the customer our customer want to make the payment i'll write it customer make the payment through by check okay by check by check okay now what will happen customer need to prepare the check and they need to send it back today is the 27th of july if today customer will prepare the check and he will send it to the okay organization what will happen again to reach from customer place to then our organization maybe it may take around 2 3 days okay so and also remember the lock box process which is most popular in us it's not in india okay and also the lock box functionality will be provided only limited banks only okay it's a, all banks will not provide all banks this is just for your interview point of view only okay the lock box is a most famous functionality in us clients only remember it's not there the lock box in india okay if you talk about india no no more in india the lock box functionality okay now we sold now the customer want to make the payment through check what will happen okay now when we sold okay sales on 27 okay 20 uh, let's say for example okay 27th july 2022 okay sales sales happened then customer okay goods when when customer received let's say for example 2022 okay customer received goods from us okay whatever we have sent okay no as now 30th july let's say for example 30th july 2022 customer customer pay the check and and sent it us sent by courier just by 
check what happened to it. Then again, our organizer take time. Okay, uh, we received check from the we received uh, check from the customer on first of August. Okay, received received check from customer. Okay, then as soon as maybe by end of the day August, if we receive the check after three thirty or four p.m. We, uh, means meantime the banks got closed. Now you cannot deposit the check for encashment. Okay, what you need to do? Okay, if it is on a first August, let us say for example the first August it is falling into the okay it's a Monday. Okay, sometimes if it is going to fall into weekends again, you need to deposit the working day only. Now let's say you have deposit, we have deposited the check August twenty two. Okay, now what will happen here? Okay, check has been check has been sent to the sent to encash. Encashment. Encashment. Again, again, maybe to credit the money into bank account, what will happen? Again, maybe if it is a local check, it is going to take 24 hours. If it is an outstation check, definitely it is going to take the okay three working days. I think it's everybody know about that one. Okay, now we have deposited check in the bank on 3rd of August. Then again, it is going to take its outstation check. Okay, 6th of 6th of August 2022. Okay, check amount. Okay, amount has been amount. Okay, amount will be credited to main bank account. Okay, amount will be credited. So now you can see here. Ikkada mana ko yemo tu nante mana mo twenty seventh rozu sale jesha mo. Then twenty eighth rozu a product to customer ki deliver jesha mo. Then 30th of August was a customer and it went to our check prepare JC Manaku by courier Dora Bumpichard. Then Manak check and it went to Manaka put a chindi first of August was a chindi. Then third of August was a manamo bank lo manama check ni deposit JCM. Okay, check has been sent for encashment or deposited into the bank for encashment. Then Manaku final ga Manaku money you put a chindi customer and chante. 6th of August we have received we have received money. We have received money from the customer on 6th of August. Ante manamo manak checku original ga checku prepare jeshne the puru 30th of August. Sorry, 30th of July. Kani manak checku amount manak main manak account lo deposit ani the puru 6th of August. So how much time duration time gap it is there here is a seven days. Means July is having the 31st 30 me from 30 to 6th means again one week time period delay is there here. Okay, to overcome this one, to overcome this delay, okay, in S in, in SAP, there is a functionality, logbox functionality. Okay, first we need to understand the business process. Okay, now the so manak e gap e time e day undo manam customer nunchi manam e day te money manam receive jes kuntamo. Dani manamu e delay e delay ni overcome jay daniki mana SAP lo. Okay, there is a functionality logbox functionality okay lock box functionality and take ENT. first of all we need to understand the first we need to understand this is a business requirement first of jesse we need to i mean when you will be there as a consultant first we need to understand the business requirement what is the business requirement this is the regular business process what it is going on in between customer and our organization when they are sending when they are making payment through check then that is the time delay is happening okay to, to overcome this situation now the SAP has been come up with okay. They introduced the logbox functionality. Okay, now what is the logbox? Now let us see. Now I will explain you the I will take the same example. First, we'll see that okay. Logbox. <coughs> okay. Logbox and then okay. I will explain you. Then customers. Okay, then I will take the same example. I will take the same example. Okay, now this is our business organization. Okay, legal entity or our company code. This is our company code. Okay, so for example, Manamo, when we are doing a business with okay customers or vendors, whatever it may be, the transactions either it's incoming transactions or outgoing transactions, all are done by through bank account only. Okay, so we cannot give uh, the cash means we cannot perform. 
the cash transactions more than 20,000. Okay, this is the rule. Okay, it's a okay. Now I have the let's say, for example, I have the bank accounts. Now let's say, for example, I have the two bank accounts. Okay, now I have the two bank accounts in my organization. One is the State Bank of India. Okay, let's say, for, okay, let us assume. JP Morgan, then is the one is the City Bank is there. City Bank. Okay, so now my organization ante manaku edaina gaani transactions okay either it's incoming payment or outgoing payment now we have the two bank accounts for my business organization now i have the two bank accounts okay okay most are the transactions most are my organization most are the transactions are happening through let us assume is a jp morgan okay let us assume the most are the transactions which are happening through jp morgan so that is the reason our organization has been decided that okay we want to okay have a log box functionality through the bank okay so log box ante enti first manaku bank accounts ikkada manamu okay we need okay we came to know we have two bank accounts okay now the log box functionality will be provided by the bank it means log box it's a kind of post box remember log box is a kind of post box okay the log box is going to set up by the bank okay ee bank manam em anukunnam initial ga manam business requirement unnapudu manaku northern region lo customers ekkuva unnaru anukunnam okay now when we have the customers when we have the more customers in northern region okay we have ante manamu mana organization em cheppindante ee bank ki okay now we have more customers in the northern region so you can set up the log box for northern region customers okay ante manam bank ki instruction ichina appudu bank em bank ward em set up chestadante then let us see the bank is going to set up the log box okay i will show you the bank is going to set up the log box bank is going to set up the okay log box for northern region customers okay so bank we change yes sir ante this bank wall of chessy manaku log box and it wanted manaku northern region low set chessy then they are going to inform and once once log box and it wanted manaku bank set up just not our water key then our organization okay means we need to communicate to the customers customer ki manam ye mani communicate just a matter log box remember log box is a log box is a post box remember post box and yen do kanto nana to not reason and explain just a no then manaku customer ki then for example now log box we have set up okay now I will remove this one. It will be confusion for you, for us then. Okay, now we have set up the now the next one is a I will take this example. Now we have sold the. Okay, now we have we have performed the sales means we have sold the goods to the this customer. HMT is in a customer. customer okay we have sales goods to the customer whatever it may be then what will happen ante okka sari manam sell chesina tarvata ki then we are going to informing to the to this customer hey we have already okay whatever the check payment you are doing check payment and payment advises okay e okay we whatever you are doing the payments related information then what you need to do you need to okay you need to no need to back and a customer come on a meme inform just a month a each check information a no need to send that checks to directly to our organization okay you need to send your checks to the log box and a year log box and a intent a man of checks to yeah that a physical the customer manako pump is that oh manako ye bank and it went to the ingest not a year log box low online
ఆన్లైన్ గా అంటే డిజిటల్ గా చెక్ ఇన్ఫర్మేషన్ అనేటువంటిది డిపాజిట్ చేయడానికి ఫంక్షనాలిటీ క్రియేట్ చేస్తుంది సపోజ్ మనం మనము ఫర్ ఎగ్జాంపుల్ మనం బ్యాంక్ వెళ్తే మనం ఏటీఎం కెళ్ళినామంటే మనకి ఏటీఎం లో కానీ మనకు బ్యాంక్ లో కానీ మనకు చెక్ కి మనకు సపరేట్ ఒక బాక్స్ అనేది పెట్టింటాడు ఓకే దెన్ ఇక్కడ మనకేంటంటే డిజిటల్ గా ఉంటది ఓకే దెన్ దిస్ కస్టమర్ నో నీడ్ టు సెండ్ ద ఫిజికల్ కాపీస్ ఫిజికల్ ప్రింట్ ఫిజికల్ చెక్స్ టు ద బ్యాంక్ సారీ టు ద అవర్ ఆర్గనైజర్ డైరెక్ట్లీ దెన్ దిస్ కస్టమర్ ఈజ్ గోయింగ్ టు సెండ్ దట్ చెక్స్ టు ద ఓకే దట్ చెక్స్ టు ద లాక్ బాక్స్ మీన్స్ డైరెక్ట్లీ లాక్ బాక్స్ లో డిపాజిట్ చేస్తారు ఈ చెక్ అనేటువంటిది దెన్ వాట్ విల్ హ్యాపెన్ ఫ్రమ్ లాక్ బాక్స్ ఫ్రమ్ లాక్ బాక్స్ ద బ్యాంక్ విల్ కలెక్ట్ ద అమౌంట్ ఫ్రమ్ లాక్ బాక్స్ ఈ చెక్ ఎప్పుడైతే కస్టమర్ లాక్ బాక్స్ లో డిపాజిట్ చేసినాడో ద చెక్ విల్ బి కలెక్టెడ్ ద బ్యాంక్ అవర్ బ్యాంక్ విల్ బి కలెక్టెడ్ ద చెక్ అమౌంట్ ఫ్రమ్ ద ఫ్రమ్ దెన్ అగైన్ అగైన్ ద ఫైల్ విల్ బి ద లాక్ బాక్స్ ఫైల్ విల్ బి సెంట్ టు ద కస్టమ్ సెంట్ టు అవర్ ఆర్గనైజేషన్ ఓకే దెన్ ఇక్కడ మనకి ఏమవుతుందంటే ఈ లాక్ బాక్స్ అనేటువంటి మనకి ఏదైతే చెక్ డిపాజిట్ చేస్తాడో ఆ చెక్ అమౌంట్ ఈ బ్యాంక్ కలెక్ట్ చేస్తుంది దెన్ ఈ ఇక్కడ మనకు చెక్ డిపాజిట్ చేసిన తర్వాత ఏమవుతుందంటే దెన్ బ్యాంక్ మనకి ఏం చేస్తుందంటే ఈ బ్యాంక్ అనేటువంటిది మనకు సపరేట్ ఫైల్ జన ద బ్యాంక్ ఈజ్ గోయింగ్ టు జనరేట్ ద ఫైల్ బ్యాంక్ లాక్ బాక్స్ ఫైల్ దెన్ అగైన్ ద బ్యాంక్ విల్ సెండ్ ఇట్ టు ద దట్ ఫైల్ టు ద అవర్ అవర్ ఆర్గనైజేషన్ ఓకే ఐ విల్ ద ప్రాసెస్ హౌ ద ప్రాసెస్ విల్ బి ద ప్రాసెస్ ఆఫ్ ద లాక్ బాక్స్ the process of the log box remember this is a very very important one for interview okay if you can try outside okay the pro wherever you can see even the videos also okay just only some blogs are there okay for the, about the log box functionality but no one has explained properly even if you want to learn outside also that is the reason please concentrate here now we'll see the process the pro process process of the lock box from where it is going to start remember now the customer as i have explained the customer means customer we have performed the sorry customer then customer remember then checks means a customer is going to send the checks remember checks r and checks and payment advice payment advice ante checks and payment advice means okay whatever the payment customer is going to make the payment on behalf of particular invoices okay the particular invoice information will be there in this payment advice form okay if we have the two invoices customer is making the payment on behalf of two invoices means the two invoice information will be there in the payment advice then as soon as customer as soon as okay customer will send this one then it goes to the bank log box remember the process bank log box means the process explain here means customer is prepared check and send it to the log send it to the okay the payment advice checks and he is preparing and he is sending that information to the okay lock box bank lock box okay then from here the format the lock box file format is a bi to file for there are two formats are there bai1 uh, sorry bai and bai2 there are two formats are there okay then if we talk about what is the difference between both now most are the 90% of the customers now we are using the bai2 file format okay bai2 file format okay what is the difference between both i will explain you later on okay now first we need to understand the process okay what is the process of the okay the log box functionality okay now log box the file format i will mention here is the now the log box we have seen then the file will sent to the sap sap system sap system 
then the file will get processed in the system. Then here, this is a complete process. Means the file format here is that it's a BI to file format. I'll mention here is that here. BA2. I will mention here the lock box. The lock box file format. The lock box file format is a BAI2. Okay. How the lock box file format looks like means there is a okay. First, we need to this is the process of the lock box. Okay. Customer from customer, then it is uh, the checks checks are, are payment advice okay whatever it may be then it is coming to to the okay log box from log box then again the file which is coming to the sap system as soon as once the file will be reached to the sap system what will happen okay manaku oka sari manaku sap system ki manaki ee log box file once we receive the log box file from the uh, from uh, uh, from log box uh, uh, to sap then what will happen the sap in sap remember as soon as as soon as as soon as sap receives receives customer okay customer as soon as it receives log box file log box file then what system does is a it will clear it will clear customer line items then option point number one then it will it will clear the customer line item it will post to the it will post to the clearing document clearing document and next one is a okay see it will clear the customer line item and it will post to the okay clearing item and also and also the business scenarios the possibility business scenarios possibility business business cases okay see by using okay with help okay with help of with help of log box file log box file we can process the we can process the customer discounts okay customer discount ante manaku customer ki manaki emaina discounts unte then based on the okay eligibility criteria the log box itself it is going to take care of that one now if it is any if okay then uh, even partial payment can be possible remember partial payment can be possible by log box functionality then the third one is a residual residual payment can be possible but remember most of the organizations will be prefer residual payment only okay residual payment ne enduku prefer chestaru anetundi nen already explain chesanu ki endukante residual payment it will clear the original invoice and it will it will create the new document for incoming amount but for partial payment it will not clear the original invoice then it will clear the it will create the new document for incoming amount means in the partial payment incoming payment document and as well as workers uh, yeah, open item the invoice item both will be open but in residual it's not like that the functionality i have already explained you okay now this is the process of that one okay now we'll explain now this is the okay the possibility scenarios means uh, through the log box uh, we can partial payment also it can be possible residual payment also possible then discounts also can be possible okay remember this are uh, and also we can process at a time multiple tech multiple customers payment at a time we can process the payment okay multiple customers payment okay now let's see then i will explain you the overview of the log box
overview of the logbox remember okay then a logbox is an account maintained by a company okay and means the manam idi edaithe manam lock box ani maatladukuntamo ee lock box ni manamu a bank manaku support chestundi lock box functionality ni means we need to set up the lock box in sap system okay the lock a lock box is an a account account maintained by a company which It's a bank. It's a bank. The account is identified by post box, post box number and address. So, here the meaning is that this a lock box is an account maintained by company with bank account means our we have instruction to the bank. Okay, we have the bank account to the JP Morgan. Then we have inst we have informed to the bank please maintain lock box for so and so customers. See and also the number the lock box identification number the number and address will be having with bank. Okay, you are the bank manaku support chest or lock box functionality key. They are having the okay the address means in which area they have set up the lock box and also the bank will be provided by the lock box number to our organization means that we have to set up that lock box number into SAP system. Remember, we have to set up that lock box number into SAP system. Okay, so then the second one is a, okay, the company the company ask its a customer means it's a the company is asked to customer to send checks, checks and remittance advisors and their and their remittance advice, right? Already. remittance advisors remittance advisors to to the log box to the log box ante manam ikkada em chestunnam ante manam customer laki inform chestunnam please don't send the checks to direct to the organization please send the checks to the okay to the lock box means the bank is going to take care of that one okay now we'll see tomorrow we'll continue the session tomorrow okay i will because tomorrow we'll finish the lock box configuration and we'll process the lock box file and we'll see that the manual manual bank statement there is a, some problem is there we'll see tomorrow okay i will check it today then we'll see that why it is not processing there is there are some errors but not sure why 